everybody, and welcome to Mixed Up Fusion Mayhem episode 19. Wow, we are only one week away from the season 2 finale. Well, let's continue to enjoy it while it lasts, eh? <laughs> Alrighty, first up we have our mixed double set, and it's quite an intriguing one. Team number one will consist of Shin Kazuma, the Dark Ninja. Yeah, you guys remember him from my random Fusion battles. He's currently dominating in singles right now. He will team up with the other half of the KFC clowns, Ronald McDonald. Man, the combo potential between those two is going to be ridiculous. They will go up against team number two. First up is the debut of Renji from Bleach. He was originally going to be on Neo's roster, but he just proved way too dominant over there. This guy is going to be extremely deadly here too. Just wait until you see him. His partner tonight will be Sailor Saturn. We don't see her very often, but if she wins tonight with Renji, she may just see more of the spotlight in Season 3. Alrighty, this battle and all other fights in Episode 19 will take place on the Law Is War stage. Hope you all enjoy! Team Ninja Clowns versus Team Bleach Moon. Let's get it on! Let's see how Kazuma and Royal fare against Renji and Saturn. Round 1, let's go! Alright, Kazuma opens up the fireball, Renji blocks counter attacks with a sword swing. Royal ends up driving Saturn, flies into an aerial wild kick, knocks her down. Royal gets with a prize stab, Saturn attacking through for energy field now. As he Royal gets the prize off, Renji trying to lay in the barrel with the sword combo, turns around, lashes down to Kazuma, the barrel back to the fireball, sends Renji and Saturn in the air, gets him with the flame tackles, he ended up getting Saturn only. Renji escapes attacking Royal on the ground. Now Kazuma caught in the corner by Renji's sword whip, Saturn holding up the front with her silent club, slams Royal down hard. Now Renji lashing out at Kazuma for five with that vicious sword string. Now Renji whipping out a super short special, and Saturn holding up the with their energy field, blasting well the Kazuma heart, right to the silence glove slashes, taking them out! Major powerhouse comboing from Renji and Saturn in round one. I really hope Kazuma and Ronald can get their shit together in round two. They need to against this team. All right, Kazuma opens up the fireball. Renji blocks it. Counter attacks with the sword whip. Ends up blasting Ronald and Kazuma down. Now Saturn holding up the front with their energy field. Kazuma trying to go through it. Gets knocked out of his special. Ronald fires off the finger fry beam. Blasts Renji across the ring. Saturn goes for a special. Ends up missing it immediately. Looks like Kazuma gets a couple throw off on Renji. Ronald tries to block Renji's sword stop. So is Kazuma. Ronald lays out an apple bomb. Fires off burgers and fry spam. Goes for another finger fry beam. Ends up blasting Saturn. Kazuma getting hit running away by Renji, whoops out another special sword whip shot, now Kazuma launches a fireball, oh my god, Ronald doing an aerial hamburger throw, Renji trying to cover the Kazuma for mine, he tries to tank Saturn, does he Renji off by Ronald's aerial last kick, right into Kazuma's explosive kick, instantly taking Saturn out, holy crap, massive turnaround from Kazuma and Ronald in round 2, and they will force it to a round 3, alright, as he Ronald leaps towards Saturn, and it's getting knocked across the ring, as he Renji, oh my god, Ronald and Kazuma fighting out of the corner, big electro fist from Kazuma, doing a butt ton of damage to Renji, and Saturn, good God! Now Royal aiming up with the price spam and the burgers! As he Kazuma launched across the ring, Royal with the aerial arrows nearly takes Renji out! Oh my goodness, looks like Renji already dead! And Saturn in a heap of trouble as she gets a special off, tries to get the energy field! Royal dies under to a sweep kick, goes for the figure fry beam, nearly takes her out, summons the Royal woman! Where the hell did Kazuma go? Looks like he went invisible as Royal off Saturn with the fight slam! And Kazuma and Royal out of nowhere have completely stolen this set 2-1 from Renji and Saturn, who seem to have things completely under control! Man, oh freaking man! I guess Kazuma and Ronald needed that round one wake-up call, because after that, they came back like bats out of hell on Renji and Saturn, and they got completely blindsided in the last two rounds by an amazing array of offense. Ay ay ay! Hell of a set to open up episode 19, in my opinion! Anyways, I can't wait to see what Kazuma and Ronald bring to season 3, and Renji and Saturn are going to be quite a force too. They pushed it to round 3, they gave them a good fight, unfortunately they came up short in the end. Hopefully they can come back with a win next season. Anyway, stay tuned for our epic 3 vs 3 showdown, which will be coming up in a moment. He is back. Now, let us begin our episode 19 3 vs 3 showdown. And tonight, we got quite a fierce one. We have the debut of Team Samurai Showdown. Paul Maru, Genjiro, and Yoshizora. I'm sure you guys are somewhat familiar with Genjiro over on Neo Mega Man's roster, one of his many deadly 1v1 stars. Yoshizora is a brand new face of the Mixed Up Fusion. We'll see what he brings to the team shortly. They will go up against Team Female Soul Ninja, who has a shot at redemption tonight. Can Katana, Molina, and Jade rebound from their crushing Boo defeat in Season 1, or will they continue to drop wins like hot potatoes? <laughs> Let's get back to the Raw is War stage and learn that answer. Hope you all enjoy. Samurais vs. Ninjas. This should be uber fun. Team Samurai Showdown vs. Team Female Soul Ninja. 
I do apologize if I lose complete control of this. Round one, let's go. All right, Gendro opens up the couple sword slices. Lina trying to tank the hitch. Goes to Sora, knocks back. We see Gendro gets uppercutted by Jade. Now Hall of fights back with the fire sword cut. Catches the Lina, goes with the fire cyclone. As see Gendro rolls away. We see Yoshi Sora got roundhouse away. Jade, Mr. Jump Kick, Hall of gets the right out of the fire sword cut. As see Gendro trying to get it out of the Yoshi Sora with the street cake. Oh my goodness, Hall of Oak knocks across the ring. As see Gendro gets the sword slice. Jade, Mr. Jump Kick, Yoshi Sora punishing her. Now see Katana caught the blur by a sword cut from Hall of Right to Yoshi Sora's split screen of aerial sword shots. Oh my goodness, Lina trying to whip out the nail spinning special. And so Kick knocks Yoshi Sora out of the air. Oh my goodness, the female soldier is buried in the corner. Looks like Katana's dead. Hall of gets the fire sword string going. Immediately goes for the blue energy sword slash, ends up taking the remaining female soul ninjas out! And Hamaru Genjiro and Yoshizor off to a strong start in round one! Let's see if they can demolish the female soul ninjas again in round two! Alright, you'll see Katana leap behind Genjiro, tries to attack with the jumping catch Hamaru instead! Yoshizor trying to get a big yellow energy wave along the ground! Hamaru with a fire sword cut the James and a fire cyclone! Genjiro trying to block Katana and Melina in the other corner! Gets the sword cut off of Katana! Melina knocks him away with a side blast. Yoshi Sora knocked out of the air. Then a teleporting jump kick for Melina. Hall of Oak Gendro trying to stay with Katana. Oh my goodness gracious. And I was like, what the hell? Get, who, who pulled off that special? I think Gendro just got like a big super special. Obliterated the female soul ninjas just like that. Damn. And Team Samurai Showdown just ended round two in record time. And they take this one 2-0 over the female soul ninjas. Hot damn in a can. I think a new beastly-ass force has just made their presence felt in 3 vs 3 tonight. Team Samurai Showdown, Haomaru Yoshizora, and Genjiro gonna be uber dangerous. And the female soul ninjas continue to job out to everyone in 3 vs 3. Come on ladies, you better turn it on soon. I'm only giving you till season 3, the end of it, to clean up your act. If you can't, you're probably gonna be moving to Neo Mega Man's roster, and if you can't cut it over there, I guess there is truly no more hope for you. I'm giving you gals till the end of Season 3. You better get something done then. Congrats to Team Samurai Showdown for their first big win in 3 vs 3. Now stay tuned folks for the big 4v4 Episode 19 main event headed your way in a moment. Alrighty Roo! Now it's time for our Episode 19 4v4 main event. And guess what? It's yet another S tier spectacle. For team number one, we have Lucy DeClonius, Mega Weapon, Master Geese, and God Orochi. That's quite a lot of major firepower for one team. Let's see how it holds up against the combo brilliance of team number two, which consists of Asatori, Aleni, Robokey, and Justice. Hot damn! This truly could go either way. Sheer power versus sheer combos. Let's see which produces better results as we get back to the Raw is War stage. Hope you all enjoy. Eek! <laughs> How the hell will I get through commentating this mess? Ay ay ay! This is going to be one majorly epic 4v4 S tier war. Lucy DeClonius, Mega Weapon, Master Geese, God Orochi, Robo Key, Justice, Asatori, and Aleti do not expect perfect commentary from this battle. I'll give it everything I've got, that's all I can promise. I'm probably gonna lose control a lot in round one. All right, no, let's see. Oh my god, all eight of them all over each other here. Mega Weapon gets in there with the Shoryuken spam. Ends up blasting Asatori. Goes for the big blue beam. Lucy goes for the energy wave special. Robo Key gets a psychic, knocks her out of it. Justice hanging back, gets the electric whip off. Now Asatori trying to get a super combo off or charging something. Oh my goodness, Justice trying to charge something too. Now it was like Master Key's tossing someone into the corner. Lucy already dead into confusion. Robo Key goes for a big combo. Looks like Eleni gets a sword slam. Got a Roshi loading energy waves. Now Asatori goes for a big glowing saber shot. I don't know if she landed it on anyone. Oh my goodness. Justice launched across the ring. Got a Rochi goes to the electrical field. Juggles Robo Key and Justice, who try to double team Got a Rochi out. Everybody else dead. Got a Rochi goes for a big pink energy beam. Takes Robo Justice down. And Got a Rochi, the only one standing in round one, winning it for his team. Let's see if Robo Key, Asatori, and Lenny can fight back in round two. Come on, guys. All right, it seems like Lucio loses the energy waves. Master Geese trying to power up too, it seems. Oh my goodness, what's going on here? The Lucy Lucio only Mega Weapon goes for the Shuriyuken spam. Lily goes for Lenny getting attacked by Robo Key in the air. Oh my god, Asatori tries to go for a sword attack. Justice trying to get a tackle off. Uh, no, no, Lenny trying to go for a sword combo. Lucy already dead in the confusion. And Robo, what the hell's going on? Lenny attacking Master Geese and got a Roji taking them out already. No, Mega Weapon, I think, is the only one left. Robo Key trying to attack him with the aerial sword combo. Asatori whipping out a special now. Is she going for Mega Weapon here? Was he Justice trying to attack Mega Weapon as well? And Mega Weapon trying to fight back here. Was he Lenny trying to get it out of the busted sword combo? Mega Weapon trying to go for a cyclone kick counter. As he knocks Robo Key back. Lenny gets a sword slam on him, knocks him across the ring. 
That's the isotory power in the electrical field. Oh my god, Mega Weapon landed the explosive grab on someone, and a lady tried to attack Mega Weapon, along with Asatori Sword Up Cut, takes him down. And Robo Key Asatori to let him fight back beautifully at round two. And we are going to a round freaking three. Once this decides to load. And round three, here we go! Oh my god, a little bit of lag here. That's to be expected in the S tier war, though. Alright, you see Justice gets caught, caught, uh, tossed in the corner by Master Geese. Mega Weapon tries to get a trigger, so he uses up. As Tori gets a short combo on Lucy and uh, Master Geese. Now he's low, he goes, as Tori takes the air, he uses a big short combo. In the meantime, Mega Weapon gets some free you can off on Justice. Tries to clip the Lenny, too, in the meantime. Let's see, Asatori charges something up. Lucy caught in the corner along with God Orochi. Mega Weapon trying to save his team. Tries to get into the multi you Shoryuken spam. Let's see, Asatori trying to get a sword combo going. And Mega Weapon knocked across the ring by Robo Key. Asatori charging up a big light, paper, light beam saber strike. And I'll see Lenny going crazy with that Buster Sword. Asatori trying to assist. And I'll see Justice getting a big uppercut combo. Catches Master Geese. And Lucy dead in the... Oh, wait, no, Lucy's still hanging in there. See, they're still attacking Lucy in the corner. And a Lenny's big Buster Sword combo. Following Asatori's energy blast. Takes out the other team! And a and and Robo Key and Justice pull a beautiful comeback! And they seal up this super set 2-1! Holy crap! And this should be called a super set, because that's what it was! An S-tier super set classic! Damn! Monster comeback from a and and Robo Key and Justice in round 2 and round 3! And this is one hell of a way to end episode 19 and start our trek towards the season 2 finale, episode 20. I clap to all 8 S-tier participants. Great show all 8 of you put on. Be proud of yourselves, whether you're the winner or the loser on this one. Ay ay ay. That was some sick action to behold. Asatori, Aleni, Robokey, and Justice, one hell of a team there. Epic combos, man. And God Orochi, Master Geese, Lucy, and Mega Weapon, monster projectile spam when they got going. Sheesh! And they do a heavy amount of damage, too. Oh my goodness. That was just crazy. I have to stop and breathe, get a drink. Hope you all enjoyed episode 19 and everything that it had to offer. And stay tuned, folks, the big season 2 finale, episode 20, coming next weekend. And I have five Grand Slam battles for you guys to end season 2 on. We got a 1v1, we got a mixed doubles, we got a 3 vs 3 showdown, then we have an A tier 4v4 showdown, and to end it all, another 4v4 S tier showdown. Uh, you're going to love the lineup I got for this one, guys. It's going to be a season 2 finale to remember. Anyway, stay tuned for episode 20 this next weekend, and I'll see you all later. Peace friggin' out all!